Eighth Grade Gifted Language Arts by Logan Andreas Hoke and Michael Schaefer. Only kids in the gifted program can take this class. Teaching gifted language arts. Um, my favorite thing about teaching gifted language arts is getting to work with kids who think really differently um, and who challenge my assumptions and their classmates' assumptions about um, issues and works of literature that um, I, I might not get to hear those perspectives otherwise. Um, if you had a chance, would you teach anything else? Um, yes, I think um, I'm, I'm also uh, certified to teach social studies and uh, regular language arts, and I did teach um, regular seventh grade language arts at Madison my first year here, um, and creative writing, and that was really fun. So I would definitely be interested in that again. Um, do you think that gifted language arts is more beneficial than normal language arts? This is a tough question. So I think that um, gifted language arts is definitely beneficial to students um, who are identified as gifted and um, I think it's, it's great to have, I think any student would benefit from the, from the small class size that gifted students have in their gifted language arts class. Um, and I do think it's great for kids to be with their intellectual peers, but I think that um, I think that it's beneficial for the gifted kids, but that small group setting would be beneficial for all kids, honestly. In gifted, students get harder assignments. Do you like being in gifted language arts? Yes, though it may seem tricky at first, you'll grow into it, and that's what makes it fun. Do you think it is more beneficial to be in gifted language arts? I think both gifted language arts and regular language arts seem both equally beneficial to get into high school where you'll be doing more intricate and difficult studies. Do you think gifted language arts is more challenging than the normal curriculum? In some cases yes, in other cases no, in other cases no, due to the fact that each lesson could be a little more difficult or easier than others. Thank you. In gifted, students go more in depth on topics. Do you like being in gifted language arts? Uh, yeah, I do sometimes because you get to do a lot of things that other classes don't do, and I don't know, she just explains more on stuff that you don't know. Is gifted language arts challenging? Um, well, it depends on what we're doing. Like, if we're doing something brand new and it's like something that we haven't even start discussing yeah it's challenging but once she explains she has a way of just telling it that way we can get it then it helps um, what is your favorite thing to do in the class I think my favorite thing to do would probably be writing essays because I'm a good writer and I don't know it's easy and I'm good at planning thanks for watching, watching.